In order for women to marry, they must compete for men. If they can't snatch a man, they could remain single for their entire lives. Men hold an extremely high status here. Even if they're destitute and living in humble shelters, they can still have multiple wives. Surprisingly, women here embrace this way of life without complaints, finding their existence remarkably joyful. This is the poorest country in Asia, yet its happiness index is astonishingly high. People in the mountainous regions live in an era of subsistence farming. Due to the high altitude terrain, viable crops are scarce, and locals often rely on cultivating potatoes for sustenance. Furthermore, with no industrial presence in the entire nation, herding livestock has become a vital means of survival. This is a veritable daughter country. In families with four or five children, there's often only one son. This gender disparity has led to more females than males in the local population. Coupled with the tradition of dowry payments by the bride's family, many women end up staying single for life. Consequently, men are highly sought after commodities in this region. To address the issue of unmarried women, an annual matchmaking event is held. In pursuit of men they're fond of, many women will even invite four or five relatives and friends to help snatch a man. When compared to the inhabitants of this region, you might find yourself considering your circumstances as fortunate. Therefore, it's important to alleviate unnecessary pressures and remember that leading a content life is ultimately the most crucial aspect.